Hello everyone, I am Saijay and welcome back to my channel, Saijay Kuri. In today's video, we talk about the, what is the best alternate cable to charge the IQ7 device. That is what I am going to explore in this video by using different different cables which I got right now as you can see friends, absolutely. And during this process of demonstration, I will try to focus. So which cable is actually supported with the flash charge? I do have the Realme cable, MI cable and normal uh, cable which I ordered from the Amazon. And during this time, I will try to see the exact charging speed using this uh, USB digital tester. So in this way, you'll be able to get to know how much speed actually the IQ7 is actually charging by using different different cables. So a lot of users did also ask me the what are the other alternate uh, chargers for the IQ7 device. I'll try to make another video on that particular topic friends. So stay tuned for those videos. So first let's get started with this kind of testing. So this is going to be really very interesting and very challenging. So first thing is that I'll try to use the default cable. So this is the default cable which came along with the box, which is a 66 uh, watt cable only. I'm trying to use right now in the in the testing, as you can see, 66 watts. Let's see how much uh, the 66 watts uh, can actually charge the phone with what kind of amperes. So in this way, I'll be able to test one one cable, and I'll try to explain you which cable actually supports completely. That is what my main motive of doing this video. And using this uh, default cable, and right now it's sh showing kind of close to I think. Uh, sorry for this that, and it's showing I think. Let's see what is the amperes it's kind of showing. 2.92, as you can see 2.92 amperes it's showing. And the volts you can see 7.90 volts. And it's showing flash charge, absolutely because I'm using the original cable, so this is how it shows. And 2.92 amperes and 7.93 volts, as you can see friends, uh, clearly using this digital meter. And you're getting absolutely all the signals. Now let me try to use a Realme cable and see what will happen if I try to use a Realme cable. And same charger I'm trying to connect during this time of testing. And this is the Realme cable which I got right now. So let's try to connect the charger. And let's see what will Realme cable will be doing. Yes, I connected the Realme cable. Let's see whether it will detect flash charge or not. Yes, absolutely it's detecting as you can see friends. So it's detecting the flash charge and it's showing exactly same current as before. There's no change in that. That's fantastic. So now we got to know one thing. In case if you don't have the IQ sound device or IQ sound cable, or maybe if you lost IQ sound cable, you can still use the Realme cable to make it work in the IQ7. That's good thing to know. Now it's the time to test the next cable, which is MI cable. So let's see, let's start with the popular uh, mobile phones and then I'll come try to use a normal cable to see what it makes any kind of difference or not. This is the MI, MI cable, which I'm trying to use during this time of testing, red color. Let's see whether the MI cable will be supported or not. And even the MI cable is also showing the same kind of results, as you can see, absolutely supported. As you can see, that's fantastic. So there is no doubt in that. So you can use the MI cables and you can use the Realme cables for the IQ7 device. That's one conclusion which we got right now. Now let me try to use the third part another uh, cable, different cables, normal. So let's see what this cable will be supported with this kind of uh, speed. So if the cables are designed to uh, withstand this kind of high capacity, then they are absolutely I think they will be able to support. If the cables are not designed to this kind of withstand a high capacity, I'm not sure whether this will detect because it's a very normal cable. As you can see, it's not detecting. It's completely stopped. You're getting exactly off, I think, one amperes. It's not supported. As you can see, friends, at this moment, it's not supported. It's not showing any sign. So this kind of cables are not supported, as you can see clearly. And let me try to do the last test using the Realme cooling clip cable. This is a Realme cooling clip, small cable, which I got. I don't know even this one won't support. So now we got to understand that the MI cable and the Realme cables are absolutely supported in the IQ7 device. So even this one also won't support. As you can see friends clearly, this one also won't support. So this is a quick conclusion friends in terms of the IQ7 charging cables. So if you want to buy the alternate cable, better go for the MI cables or the Realme cables. Those will be only will be supported in the IQ7 device. I think uh, you got the answer exactly what you're looking for. And I'll try to make another video friends how to find the alternate chargers. So that is what a lot of people that did ask me what kind of different different chargers will be supported. I'll try to make another video on that particular topic. And see you in the next video friends. I'll stay tuned for more updates. Bye.